Okay. Stuff and things and things and stuff. Move this over. I'm sure nothing's gonna break. There it goes. I have no game audio. Why don't I have game audio? Hmm. Why, why don't I have game audio? Where did the game audio go? That's all. I take the phone, that's game. Should not be muted. As indeed channel one. Uh, routing. Ah, that's why. Found it. Yep, there it is. Um, as in, does it record your chat like YouTube does? So like if you type some rambling stuff, does it keep it? Just making sure I understood the question. While we sit in a never-ending loading loop. It'll figure itself out in a minute. Uh, I can fix that for you. I do this. Oh, they did not make that as easy as I thought it was. That's probably because I'm in Streamlabs. Let me, let me do that in Twitch here. I do this and then, uh, do this. Nope. Nope. That ain't it. Uh, yeah, it does store it. Oh, that's right. We logged out in Everest in the last episode. I forgot about that. I need to figure out how to... Uh, it's just how I have the settings in Twitch. This is probably... If anybody views this back, it'd probably get me kicked slightly, but Twitch is largely less mature than YouTube is. And due to that, it's far more strict on things than YouTube is. And its settings are far more harsh. I'm trying to just add you as a mod because that makes the most sense. But, um, yeah. Hold on. Oh yeah, that's the command for it. I knew that. It's just a uh, copy paste your name because I'm lazy. Do that, do that, do this. Close that. Type this. There. Type something, JT. There. You can do whatever you want now. Let's get back to this. Uh, People whining about the F8C. Just learn how to fight the bloody thing. Uh, 
open. Thank you. Glad I could help. I'm kind of afraid of these elevators because these are the ones that we fell through. Well, no, we, we fell through the other ones. So we've got to grab the A1 and make our happy way back to Microtech. Mostly because I want it parked there if I'm not going to use it. And all my parts are there, so I can't outfit the scout. Welcome to the ASOC vehicle retrieval system. Uh, there you are. Vehicle selected. Your vehicle has been delivered to the following location. Not that I hate the A1 at all, but eh. In some ways, it doesn't quite fit what we're doing, and in others... It it has its use, but I don't own the ship, and I don't really want to use a loaner ship for these ser for the series. Are any of these elevators going to work? Are we thirty k? Did we thirty k? I think we thirty k. Yeah, we did. I need a soundboard with a womp womp sound effect from one of the VTubers every time that happens. <laughs> I'm fairly sure she wouldn't mind, maybe? I don't know. Um, the last video I used that ending music from Always Sunny in Philadelphia. That would also be acceptable every time that happened. Price is Right is also good. I probably shouldn't have tried to join in that fast, but we'll see what happens. I think it was on Reddit or somewhere. Somebody had commented to me that, oh, hey, 30Ks are a dying breed these days. I think in every video I've done, I've hit at least one 30K. So that's 32 30Ks. <laughs> this is now like 33 in, in two weeks. So that's almost two a day. It's trying to do something. It's just being very slow about it. There it goes. We spawned. Uh, F12 again. Hold down button. And... Deja vu moment. Open you. There was an attention thing and then it just never went through. And we're in seven. I think it's working this time. Okay. 
I mean, I kind of hate to abandon the thing because I'm, it is really pretty. Yeah, I, I, I caught them. I know roughly what they all are, but the weird leggy, like, debilitated dog looking one. Which one? The debilitated dog looking one? <laughs> um, it might be if they've changed this, changed the silhouette. Or uh or its design has changed a bit. I mean it's been six months, so its design could have changed a little bit. But yeah, everybody, everything else I, on there I knew. I'm, I'm a, I'm a little sad about the order of the Polaris and the Perseus. But that's only because I'm biased towards the Perseus. I need to um, try to remember if my paints are out here at Microtech. I think they are. I want those new quantum effects. These are pretty and all, but the, the ones in that preview spline were really pretty. Was what because of the e external view? Oh no the 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 quantum they showed in that preview is new art for it entirely. So like all of this should end up looking like what they had. The only thing in that whole thing I'd say were really was really like splotched together and kind of looked a little hacky was the jump point, but that's because the jump point was most likely very hacky and kind of spliced together. That and the the shot with the gladius over the water. Like JT was in my stream. Like he he probably picked up on me pretty instantly, saying that looked incredibly fake. It looked better when they actually did the fly through with the the actual demo of it. Back when they were doing the the spline preview of everything and went to the jump point and had the gladius go over the water, I don't know, you may have been dealing with your kids, but I had mentioned it looked really fake. All right, enjoy whatever it is you're doing. Ah, yes, enjoy enjoy your tats.
Yeah, it was a lot, lot better the second time around. Sorry, just Discord real quick. Okay. I don't have the game to go to background, I should. Uh, they said 0.22, so it's all coming in at once, I think. The new clouds, all of it. So the next patch. I came to Microtech. I don't think I told it to take us to Babbage. I did not. I mean, depending on how they do it, it won't be that bad. My only concern is just how much they're offloading onto GPUs. Like, there's going to be a point where you're going to start overloading GPUs and then the CPUs won't have anything to do. I don't know if there's a proper balance going in. Not unless they suddenly want to give all of us 4090s. We can certainly hope. Get to the spaceport and start moving ships. Somebody's down there on the... I gotta cycle the quantum drive. There we go. Somebody's down there on the, the, uh, on the lake. Yeah, we'll buzz the trains, why not? We're here and we haven't done it in this yet. Well, she might be a little bit big for what I'm about to do. Oh, she's kind of flat. Wide and flat, so it might be fine. Thank you. Yeah, I'll contact you in a moment, dude. I mean, and they, they like, like I said, they might make an attempt at um, like balancing it out beforehand. I mean, everything, everything could go through an optimization pass. Do lights do anything for us? Because I definitely want to try to fly under this, but I'm choosing to do it in a storm. I know I have to be around 150 meters because that's what the lightning can do it in, so. Gently. We do this slow the first time. Twenty three, twenty two, twenty twenty four is the height 
that I roughly need to stay around. Okay. Or 30. 30 is good. Hopefully somebody was on the train. Let's uh, talk to the spaceport. Please proceed to assign landing bay. Are you going to show me the landing bay? We need to turn off our lights before we get blinded. Considering we're considered a rather large ship, it's going to be up here any on one of these pillars, most likely. Hopefully nobody just jets out of one of these uh, hangars. Yeah, so about that landing bay. Do we want to try that again? Request is already being granted. Oh crap, where is it? Someday we'll get our landing pad. Gonna back up a little bit just so I can kind of see everything. And randomly spam the Gib landing pad thing. That request is already being granted. is all down here. When, like, what is going on? Clips. A1. F8. Another F8. Whole lot of F8s. Then A1. A1. That is probably why I'm not getting a landing pad, is there's a whole bunch of A1s just sitting in pads. I mean, I put down how many tickets and gave away how many? That request is already being granted. Yes, it has been granted, but you have not given it to me. So instead, we're stuck patrolling back and forth until you actually give me a landing pad. I don't really want to pay the fines. That's assuming we can find an open door. Because I can't really use my lights right now. Like, it should have been one of these, but they just never... That request is already being granted. You lie, sir. <laughs> yeah, I have an idea. Landing pads down. Landing gear down, rather. Down. 
I'm just gonna go out here to the lake and then land and then pass out in the bed. It ensures that it picks me up on Microtech. So even if it doesn't spawn me here, it should still spawn me on Microtech. We might lose these two in this exchange, but I mean, I have more. Ship and landing area, so it knows we're in a landing area. Oh, look, our golden ticket's still on the floor. We'll do another flyover and then we'll just fly outside this area and land and do the same thing. Come back in on a server that doesn't have 500 ships just parked around it. Got to get out of range of the spaceport now, which is going to be kind of annoying. Landing gear up. We will sort this out eventually. Really wish they would have released the C1 first. This in theory should be far enough away. if we can find a place to land up here. That glow is kind of pretty. I'm not sure why outside looks fine, but inside looks very sideways. All right, let's try to go to sleep again. Ship is in landing area. I am nowhere near a landing area, but all right. We'll keep going.
I have another answer for this. Yeah, it's definitely having one of those moments. So it's going to yell at us about being in... Atmosphere next. So I'm going to ping to one of these data centers. We're just basically going to go straight down. I have no idea what's beneath us. That bright blue light is very distracting. Looks like mountain. And we try again. Yay. Now we wait a second and see if we get on a server that isn't absolutely packed of weirdness. I don't know, I can't say I've ever had a problem with uh, Cheez-Its. That said, I've also not had Cheez-Its very much in my life, so... They never quite were a go-to snack, but... That's also because I don't really snack all that much.
Who knows if we're on a different server? We can only hope. Crusader Industries, a journey worth taking. Systems on. Gotta cycle the engines because they're bugged. That up is so enthusiastic. And let's turn that off. Just don't need to see chat. I should find my little rotating um, channel icon for when I don't feel like or nor want to have the camera on, just so something's in that corner. <laughs> All right, let's try to get to Microtech, or New Babbage, rather. Um, I don't know, man. All my huts look like this. Mind you, on I'm a 1440p monitor with all at 1440p. with a display port connection at like 230 hertz or some craziness. Bonus right now is that I don't see a billion ships down there. You know, I probably could have landed and just walked in through the garage. Or over there where the other um, service elevator is. Landing bank. Nope, we are definitely on the same server. We'll do a flyover, see if it gives us a swan. If not, we'll land and try to get in through the garage door. We'll do this the other way. Let's see if I can remember where that entrance is. Oh, 
something blew up over there. Let us pretend we've landed. Stop the ship. There you go. Let's plop her down here. Oop, dip, 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 dip. Too far. Let's make sure the gear's down. The gear is not down. Uh, I have no idea what it was. It was too small. Dude, the only UI change I want them to make right now is that gear icon, when they're down, make it red. When they're up, make it green. That's all I want. All right, we're out of the ship. Get out of the ship. Maybe we'll get out of the ship. If the ship wants me to get out of the ship, we'll get out of the ship. There we go. Okay, we're all getting thrown around a little bit. With any luck. It'll put everybody on Microtech. Or in New Babbage, anyway. Just gotta get inside the landing pad sphere of influence, I guess. We'll see if it's there. If it is, we'll claim it and get all the stuff off of it. If we just lost everything in it, that's fine. We'll just get it back. I'm used to flight simulator, which is, so I'm used to actually looking for the lights on the landing gear to make sure they're all working and all of that. So not having that is far more debilitating to me than it, it should be. I should stream flight sim just to stream it, but I've got some slight kinks to work out with that. What is going on with the connection? All the important people are at CitizenCon. There it goes, the spot. Yeah, I mean, those lights are not infallible at all, but they're better than absolutely nothing. And right now, we have absolutely nothing. Let's see what it did with the A1. Oh, it's here. So it stored it properly. We'll go get everything off of it.
straight to the spaceport. Capsule now approaching station. Stand clear of disembarking passengers. So talk to Diabolus a little bit after his little win. And apparently, for whatever reason, the, the dude didn't even expect to like place. And, and I don't see how when he had like a winning costume, but. Nah, he was cool with it. He was just happy he got something. The only thing I was um, concerned about was because he won something. Like, if you try, if like if any of those guys were from the UK, and they tried to take that Toby into the country, they would have to play pay VAT on it, which is just a tax, which is a very high tax. Um, I was a little concerned he'd have to pay it, but apparently Australia doesn't do stupid shenanigans like that. And yeah, he certainly should have won. I mean, Brea, Latha, whichever service you're on, she can attest to whatever stupid shenanigans Australia does. She's the resident Aussie. Yeah. Let's let's get in the A one. Well, first, let's uh, we have to deliver you because I need to put equipment on you and I need to retrieve you. So step one is putting stuff on you. Paint needs to be ghoul. Did you have a different color? Eh, kinda. One of those. One of those. Wait. One of those. One of those. All done. What did they say? Ten? Where is it? Ten. I need to grab the ticket off of it and put it on one of the tables over there. Let's go, pretty girl. Let's put you back and get stuff off of you and put you back in storage. Uh, I want th this on vehicles, that on that, and oh, I need to go grab the plushies.
No, you can always... Why is storing unavailable? Can I store it if I leave? Um... You're always free to make that decision after I grab the cutter and do stuff with it. Storing is... Uh, I think I know how to do this. Yep, that's how I had to do that. He's going to be down in here somewhere. There he is. That means I have to do that with the storm wall, too. Um, no. How Citizen Con works is there. there's a very select... amount of people that actually are at the convention the rest are still working so like there's going to be a chunk of people at the manchester studio or even the la studio or austin studio actually still at work these guys not being able to be stored is just kind of a problem that's existed Now we can go on, go into the ship and move stuff. Which does not count just being on the ramp. Undersuits. Armor. Fine, we can put them in sustenance. Utility. And ammo. There's still a very light monitoring skeleton crew over Christmas. Um, if things just absolutely started going haywire, there would be people they could call in. But generally, there's no build push just before Christmas, like just before that vacation, because it, it, it gives buffer time for bugs to be fixed before everybody leaves. That were that was mine because there was absolutely nothing I could do over that time. That was not within my job category. Welcome to the ASOP vehicle retrieval system. Your vehicle has been placed. I mean, externally, she's not all that different. There's the radar top. The engines are different. Front end is the same.
That audio is all kinds of broken. Sounded better closing. You don't do anything yet, do you? Uh, nope. Well, the ship's also not on, so maybe that's it. All right, so test one. We've got to go into local, go into other. We'll take snowboarding dude, plop him there. I tried to put that in my hand. I failed miserably. Did they fix it? Nope. Still can't put anything on that bed. That's fine. These guys can hang out out here. Wait, is that the SCU space? What is the SCU space? SCU space now. Uh, come here. Can't see what I'm doing. Hang out there. Good man. Uh, well, it's clearly not going to be there, so I guess it's these two slots. Nope. It's this one and uh, this one, I guess. So it's these two. Unless 2SCU is one box and then it's just this guy. Oh, you know what? It might just be that guy. It could just double stack here. That would make sense. Uh, it's either one box or it double stacks there. Uh, this is rearranged slightly, but I mean, it seems fine. They fixed this in, in this version. That's nice. Taps don't work. I feel like it lost something. Was there a shower? Oh, no, never mind. It's all one can combined unit now. Toilet still works. This is ship storage. That's weapon rack. I mean, really didn't lose any. Like I said, you don't. Don't really lose anything in here. It didn't have a whole lot to begin with. It's pretty sparse in this area. Still can't use the overhead bins. Back here is just nice because it's bulkier. Like they probably could have made the original the base like six SCU SCU or something if they'd done this with it. Yeah, 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 move out, I know. I'll do the thing whenever we're doing something. We have penguin. I don't know if I can put the haunted storm wall anywhere. Definitely said place, not drop. Yep, he can be haunted back there. That's okay. Did we close the door? We did.
Don't need targeting. We're never going to really be targeting anything in this. You are clear to launch. Let's see if we can't find a job. Oh, we haven't done any salvage since the patch, so we're back to doing just having these two. How is it? That it's a brand new ship and that left engine is still broken. Now oh well. This is brand new, dude. Like I just, this is the upgrade from the base. This is the scout. So this is the first time it's ever been spawned. The base was broken when I parked it, yes. But it was... It was repaired, but it was broken. Basically, nothing was wrong with the ship, but the engine still didn't work. The problem, I think, is because it's not... Um, It's not in this list. Rear, lower, right, main, left, main, right. No, no, it's there. And it, as far as the ship is concerned, it works. Cause if I just, like I just turned it off and the whole ship started wanting to bank the other way. So there's definitely nothing wrong with it as far as like health or in being attached or anything. That's too far. That too is too far. We've got absolutely nothing close enough, so we're we're flying to it. Yep, turn it off and turn it on again, does nothing. That one over there also seems to have some piping issues. Or maybe it's not really piping issues. It's just uh, something else. Maybe it's actual heat in the pipe. Who knows? Can't imagine there'd be much though, not out in space, and it's exposed. I'm gonna have to eat something and drink after this. I don't think I brought the water with me, did I? I did not. 
Oh, this is going to get exciting. Should I go out to Magda after this? The question is, does this have more range than the... It looks like it does. He can make the jump. Kill speed. Guess I'll just submit this as a bug. I have another one from the video I put out today anyway with the A1. Slight landing gear bug with it. Why in the world do I have 500,000 Discord messages? Anyway.
get down here where we can't really see anything. And then we'll take the new girl out to the Magda jump point. That'll be where we get food and water and whatever else. It's going to be one hell of a jump, but that's fine. All right, it says clear hostile occupants from this place. I'm curious if we'll, if there's any going to actually spawn. They did earlier in the A1 video. But the mission didn't need, like, they weren't part of the mission. They were also very much immune to bombs. We'll do a low pass scour of it. See if anybody's down here. Okay. Doesn't look like there's anybody on the ground. Everybody stare well, stare well where I put them. You I trust. The one I don't trust is this guy. Well, that's going to make everything unhappy. Let's just raise that. Upside of the cutter's headlight is apparently it is multi-directional as it shines just as much in like a 120 degree arc, but it splashes weird, like each of those arcs have their own arc. So basically it just splashes in like this really weird cone all the way around and back, kind of back behind it, but not in like a normal way. Is there anything in here? Uh, just vault back out of that. Pretend that didn't happen. Head down this way, see if anybody spawns. Loot the box. Nothing in it. What is? Oof. Out. Out.
Ah. I legitimately don't know the last time I heard a Creed song. We're just going to float down this mountain. Can't help it. Hit it from this side. Pembroke Hellbent RSI Ivory Edition. Eh. Storm picked back up. I think that's pretty much every part of this. We'll get back to the scout and see if uh, a cutlass or something spawned. Kind of annoying because I mean these missions were bugged in the last patch too and just nobody fixed them. And it's like I I know they were reported. It's like it's these style of missions that end up costing you rep because you have to abandon them. stuck in open position apparently. Okay. We'll worry about it when we get near. Or we're 30Kng again. I think we're 30Kng again. Yep. That's two in an hour and 25 minutes. But I still want to get out the Magda, the Magda jump point. So we're, we'll come back in. We'll just, that'll be just what we do. I will set the stream goal and we will actually do it.
should make a 30k compilation compilation of the last two weeks. I've got every single one of them on video. Waiting for it to catch up. There it goes. They can't implement that uh, replication layer stuff. Soon enough, like that, it needs to just be here. No food, no water until we reach Magda. With the rate we're going, I'll probably die before that happens. And this server has frame issues ever so slightly. Waiting on a train, just waiting on a train. Capsule now approaching station. Stand clear of disembarking passengers. Capsule now approaching station. Stand clear of disembarking passengers. Yeah, you've said that once already, lady. Riding on a train. That's concerning. Seeing the void before the doors close.
Welcome to the ASOC Vehicle Retrieval System. Vehicle select your vehicle. Okay, fine. Don't tell me where it is. Welcome to the ASOC Vehicle Retrieval System. Hangar 4. Oh, now it's going to tell me. All right, let's get the ship on. Get the doors open. Get our jump point set. Cycle the engines. Check to see if our engine is still broken. Yes, it is. And get the hell out of Dodge. So we're going to be at this for a minute. Good time to go see if that uh, scanner does anything. Still doesn't even power on. Oh, there it goes. So many screens.
You know, oddly, it could be useful to have somebody back here doing this. It's a shame there's no, like, small window around here. Oh, we can turn the light off. Apparently can't turn that light off, it just, it's bright or dim. And no light control for this room otherwise? Nope, it's right here. It's just like mood lighting or bright lighting. Seven thousand left.
I don't know if I want to think of the quantum time. If you were to do this from Terra. That's a heck of a trip. Nice little sunroof I never noticed. Hey, we're almost there. And we didn't die of thirst and or hunger. Should start popping up any second now. There it is. ourselves to the gateway. Welcome to the bang this jump point.
You are clear to launch. Please um, proceed to assign landing bay. There you go. You got it right the second time. Hello. I wasn't expecting this place to use the drop down into hangars. I thought they got rid of all these on space stations. For the small ships. See, either that or it just gave me a hangar much bigger than what. should normally be in. Let's get the nose down. Hey, we made it. Let's go get food and drink. See if I can remember where anything even is on here. Fire assembly, do not block. Ah, there's the food court signs. Just put that in there. I need whatever that is. And I guess another one because we were only at like 80%. And now to try to find normal water. Close enough.
Place that in... Oh, okay, he's slightly bugged with this. Uh, drop it. Or just store it. I'll throw it away later. All right, so got food, got water, made it out to the Magna Station. Wanted to see if there was any contracts out here. Nothing really. Saw which contracts out here. That's kind of neat, but they're all the way back in the main systems. All right, so I'm just going to go ahead and uh, cut things off here, I think. Just to... Give myself a break and all that fun stuff. So thank you for watching and hanging out and I will talk to you all later.